welcome to Modern Vibes with Dr. Jared the First, episode 295. It's Friday, the sixth day of July 2018. My names are Dr. Jared the First Oguzi. I have a question for you today. Do you want to be rich? Then master these seven lessons on getting rich. After seeing the recommendation to read the book The Richest Man in Babylon by George S. Clarkson for likely the hundredth time, I finally did it. Now I wonder what took me that long. So now I make this recommendation to you. If you have not read this book, don't wait. It's easy to read and insights on wealth, business, work and life are invaluable. The book outlines a seven-step repeatable process that anyone can learn and follow to build wealth. Here's a brief overview of the lessons shared, which I have termed the seven lessons on getting rich. 1. Start thy pause to fattening, meaning pay yourself first. 2. Control thy expenditures, meaning Live within your means. 3. Make thy gold multiply, meaning invest your money. 4. Guard thy treasures from loss, meaning invest wisely and have insurance. 5. Make of thy dwelling a profitable investment, meaning own your own home. 6. Ensure a future income, meaning plan for retirement. 7. Increase thy ability to earn, meaning invest in yourself by improving your own knowledge, abilities, and skills. Wealth building requires work. A main theme of the book, The Richest Man in Babylon, that I want to comment further upon is the principle that you have to work your way to success. Most of us will prefer life to be easy, where all our wishes are fulfilled immediately without strain. This desire in human nature is why get-rich-quick schemes, the lottery, and easy money adverts grab our attention and lure us in. The lesson we need to learn, the lesson we need to learn, however, is that the first step to building wealth is to embrace work. Only by putting in time, energy and effort do we learn how to make our business succeed. Through working, we discover what makes money and what does not, such as what makes a prospect respond to our email ad or not. Overnight riches and success are fantasy. Even those who win the lottery statistically have no money left after a few years later. Why? Because the individuals receive the money, but have never learned how to make or handle money. Only when you put in the effort to learn how, do you acquire the secrets to financial security. Thus, when you spend money, rather than going broke, you can replenish the money. In my own experiences, I often hear from new subscribers that it is difficult to get people to sign up for your email list. These individuals expected to set up a landing page for their list and then instantly get requests for their information. Their thinking is just not realistic. To them though, doing the work to create a website and continually publish content about their business is just too much effort. They never accept the principle that success requires work. Another example I see of others being impatient is with email marketing advertisers. People will question the effectiveness of email ads. These advertisers are are judging the results of their email campaign on the click-through rate of a single email of their offer. These marketers neglect to realize that email marketing takes work. It's a process. Over time, email marketing does succeed as it builds brand awareness and loyalty with a subscriber list. One shot attempts when the list members are unfamiliar with your company are likely to be a struggle. 
But regular exposure to a list, running multiple ads, as well as taking the time and effort to contribute valuable information, will get you results. The key to achievement is accepting work and making work your best friend. Embrace your work as the source of your success and happiness. Only then will you have the determination and the willingness to keep working until you succeed. Thus, when plan A doesn't work, you move to plan B. And if plan B fails, you try plan C and all that and all that. Any endeavor you wish to succeed at is going to take work. If you want to build a responsive opt-in list, develop a successful paid e-sign, generate results from your email marketing, or close more sales on the affiliate program you are promoting, the trick is to get to work. You're not going to make tons of cash as soon as you get started, but as you keep working over time, you will succeed. Now, to help you to get started on working your way to success, I recommend that you continually visit this platform, Morning Vibes with Dr. Jerry the First, so that you can continue to learn and continue to interact with us for your own progress and success. Once more, remember to get that book, The Richest Man in Babylon. If you don't have it, buy the hard copy or go to the link in, the, in this blog post and download the free copy. Until I come your way again, this is Morning Vibes with Dr. Jerry the First. This program is powered by Top Top Media Communication Nigeria. All rights reserved. Thank you for listening to this broadcast today. It would please us to no end if you continue to visit our podcast. And so to be able to do that, kindly click on the red subscribe button towards your right to subscribe to our channel. In the same vein, also click on the bell beside the subscribe button so that you can always receive the notification for any new podcast we upload. Also give us a thumb up to like this podcast. These help us to grow. And do help us share the podcast to your friends in the different social media sites you belong to. Click on the share tab just below the podcast and share directly from there. The full text of this podcast is on our blog. And would you want to read it, kindly visit the blog. We have a Facebook page where we also post our podcast on a daily basis. If you're on Facebook, kindly like our Facebook page. The links to our blog and our Facebook page are in the description box right below. Thank you for your attention. Do have a very nice day.